We have singer-songwriter, of course, Tina Parole here with us, as well as Matt Script on the guitar. This is fantastic. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having us. Yes, so first of all, if you aren't familiar with Tina, Tina, tell folks out there who you are, what your music is, and why you're so excited to be back in Buffalo. Yes, well, I'm originally from Buffalo, so this is my hometown. Mm -hmm. I currently live in Nashville, Tennessee, and I've been writing songs professionally for about 18 years now, which yes. is wild. Um, and this I, is just not just writing songs, okay? She told me, she gave me the background on this. <laughs> You've written songs for some really big name stars. So yeah. tell us, just give us a little bit of background. Yeah, I've written songs for Britney Spears, Celine Dion, Lady A, um, Sabrina Carpenter, a bunch of artists, Tenille uh, Tenille Towns as well. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and I've been writing songs professionally for a while, and I also write my own music, yeah. which I license to films, TV shows, and commercials. So. A little company called Disney. <laughs> <laughs> I yep. have to mention that because they are our parent company yes. of our ABC affiliate. Yeah, I worked so. for Disney for a while. Yes, yeah. that's fantastic. So being back in Buffalo is big for you because yes. you're here to help a local cause, which is actually a national, global cause. Right. But you're able to reach some folks here about raising awareness. Tell us about that. Yeah, so I recently had scoliosis surgery, mm. which is a very intensive surgery. I was diagnosed with scoliosis when I was 11, wore a back brace, and then it just came to the point where I had to do something more about it. Right. Um, through that journey, I wrote a record that was inspired about the whole surgical process and how you know I felt around it. It was a very scary thing. Mm -hmm. um, and after I released it, I decided to partner with this organization, which is Buffalo-based, called World Spine Outreach. And they facilitate scoliosis surgeries in countries where there aren't a lot of scoliosis surgeons. Um, so any of the proceeds from this album, a, a portion of them rather, go to World Spine Outreach. And I'm really excited about it. Knowing what the surgery has done for you, mm -hmm. how important is it that folks really step up, help this organization to help others throughout yeah. the globe. I honestly can't imagine what my life would have turned into if I had not had it. Mm. Um, I had the surgery when I was 33 years old and that's still relatively young, but my body was you know, in debilitating, debilitating pain daily. Yes. Um, so it's so important. The work they do is absolutely incredible. They literally change lives. Scoliosis can be fatal. If the curvature gets too large, it can actually impact the heart and lungs and puncture them and cause death. So it's an incredibly important surgery. For folks out there who aren't familiar with scoliosis, I know when we were young, we all got checked for scoliosis, yes. but tell folks out there what exactly this is. So it's a curvature of the spine. It's a mm -hmm. severe curvature. Once it hits around 55, 60 degrees, they recommend surgery. Mm -hmm. So a lot of the um, work that World Spine Outreach does, they'll go to countries where curvatures are 100 degrees, 120 degrees, and are nearly fatal. They're doing incredible work. And just to give people perspective, you told me this during the break, and I couldn't believe it, but it gave you how many inches when you had your <laughs> surgery because of the curvature yes. of your spine? I gained correct? four inches in height. Yes. Which is really wild. I'm still used, getting used to the new, yes. the new body. Yeah. Yeah. But being able to have this different experience on life has really helped you. And you also want to help others. So that's fantastic. Thank you so much for being on AM Buffalo. Thank We're going to hear her beautiful music in just a bit. So stay with us. You're watching AM Buffalo.